Welcome back to Jolly Jilly's Crafts. Please remember to like and subscribe. I upload every Tuesday, so welcome my Jolly Jillies back for another Dollar Tree haul. This one is a bit small, but it is full of impact. It's Christmas, Halloween, it's kind of a cornucopia here. So let's do it. All right, the first thing are these wired garland ties, and they're really good for Christmas crafting. So you can make little wreaths and hang them on your kitchen, which I like to do, one of my most fun things um, or filling in um, Dollar Tree has Christmas tree trees that are very sparse so you can fill in the branches and stuff okay that's really cool more Christmas stuff these excellent wooden stickers little trees presents and snowflakes um, they do have a little sticker on the back but whatever you put them on you're gonna want to use a glue gun because a sticker is not that good and I have two of them okay so one was stockings and candy canes and mittens so that's that. Very cool. More stuff. Now it seems. Oh, and look at these. They're little campers. And there's two. Two for a dollar twenty-five. And look, I just wanted to show you. Big camper, small camper. Big camper, small camper. So fun. And that's what I got earlier in the summer from um from Michaels on sale. And now these are so cute. I can decorate the big camper with the small campers. A couple of other things I have. There's so much Christmas stuff out of the Dollar Tree right now. It is amazing. So, these are little red Merry Christmases. Okay. They're really cute. They're very sparkly and cute. You can put them on things. You can put them on wreaths. You can put them on garlands. Really super cool. Now, last year, I was obsessed with these red trucks. I had red trucks all over. It looked like a red truck exploded in my apartment. So I got three more of these because they're really awesome to decorate with and they say Merry Christmas underneath. So here's the second one and the third one is in this bag here somewhere. So, and the third one because I love them so I just got extra. Now there's some um, Halloween stuff. So this is more dec deco mesh. So I got two of the black. I got two of the orange and two purple. Let me see the purple I think are in this second bag here. It doesn't matter. It's fine. Um, I also got this. Now these are really, really cool. I use them for Christmas as well. This tinsel stuff comes right off and then you cut off the little plastic things that are underneath it. Or if you like it for Halloween, just you do you boo. All right. Mm. But when I did them for Christmas, I took off all of the stuff and I rewrapped it with like burlap ribbon and made it very like country cozy. And I gave them to my aunt for Christmas last year. Um, Another Christmas, it's very kind of mixed up in these two bags, but this is more Christmas. It's gold. The other one was red, and this says Merry Christmas. It's really beautiful. Um, they come five in a pack. So, I mean, so much DIY potential with these things. Um, and then there's this, I'm going to open it, actually. It's fabric. It's unicorn fabric. And I've seen the Southern Girl can and everyone making these plates. And what you do is you Mod Podge fabric on the back of these clear plates. And I need to do that with my life because it's awesome. And so I found this really cool unicorn um, paper, or pardon me, fabric pattern that I want to do on the back of two plates. So it's so gorgeous. There's this little girl that I know that loves unicorns. So I want to do that for her. I mean, let's see. Look at the unicorns and the rainbows and the stars. I love it. It's adorable. And I think it's, let me see. Yeah, it comes in a really big, so you could do like four plates with this. You just use the small plates and you Mod Podge it on. And then um, you can, apparently there's like a dishwasher safe Mod Podge you can use. But I mean, you would really want to hand wash these anyway. But I mean, how pretty is this fabric? It's absolutely gorgeous. And it's amazing. Also, I got this, um, the witch is in, and it's her little cute hat and little cute shoes. It's really cool, and you can take them apart if you just want to use the hat and the feet for a wreath, um, or if you just want the middle piece, the witch is in. That's right, I'm in. Um, now, I got this keychain, this breakaway, that's not a keychain, it's called a, what's it called? A lanyard for my keys I really liked it it's super super pretty with these little polka dots really beautiful I think I want to change up my keychain look a little bit um, now bag one is completed now on to bag two and it really is like a Mod Podge of Christmas and Halloween 
Um, so, last year I made some wreaths and I used these as the top of the wreath. <laughs> um, not for me, not for my face. But it's really cute because you can put this on the top and then you do little witch feet on the bottom that you can just fill in. And I bought an orange one and a purple one. And when you're making the wreath, if you wanted to do it, the best thing idea is to stuff the hat because it's kind of like wonky bonky like it bends down. But if you fill it and stuff it, it's more full and it looks much better on the wreath. So I got two of those. I got an orange one and a purple one. Okay. Now we're coming to the end of the haul here. Very sad. Now these are absolutely gorgeous. They're like, yeah, they're eucalyptus, but they're beautiful silvery eucalyptus and I just grabbed them right away um, I think they had two colors I'm not 100% sure I hadn't think they didn't have gold I think they might have had maybe a brown or a red because it was in the Christmas section um, so I got two of these and they're absolutely gorgeous they would look so beautiful on like a winter white wreath oh that would make it just pop um, but that is just gorgeous and I finally found my two purple deco meshes and these are really great again for Halloween wreaths um, really really great I love them they make things look so nice um, and I got some fancy fashion pens which I might just take to work they're really really cool and it's three in a pack so it really cannot go wrong um, let me see I'm gonna take them out because they're kind of cool I really really like this one it's like teal with a little bit of plaid on the top and on the bottom and it writes in black ink um, and it says includes three ballpoint pens in black ink so this is one and then there's the other two so you can kind of see two other ones in there if you look really closely um, one has flowers and then one has really cool sayings on it let it go you can do it oh very nice inspirational pens so cute actually there's a couple more things i think i only have stickers left to show you guys but i hit the jackpot with the stickers today so whenever i see stickers like letter stickers or number stickers i tend to pick them up now this these are called poster stickers and they are the alphabet this is amazing these are really, really good for DIYs. A lot of us don't have crickets. I personally don't have one. Um, but these are really, really great. You can put them like on the back of posters. If you're making a sign for your wall, you can put them on. You just want to make sure that once you put them on, you Mod Podge them or put something else to make sure they stay. Because even if you put them on the walls, sometimes you'll notice they come off the walls. So you'll want a secondary source to make sure it stays on whatever you're doing. But because I was so excited about this, I got three. I was, it was like, this is my favorite purchase today. Honestly, I got so excited when I saw these. I just looked and I was like, woohoo, that's fantastic. Now the last, I'm down to the last two items. They're also stickers. Um, let me see. And they are Toy Story stickers. Four. One is a Stickerland activity book. And this is really, really cool because it has not just, okay, so it has really cool stickers, but not just the stickers. If you look, there's like coloring activities, there's more coloring activities, there's places for you for kids to learn to read to learn to write they have to make the word woody what letters do you use it's really really awesome and these pages here you can put on and remove stickers I remember when I was a kid sticker books were all the rage and all I ever wanted for Christmas was stickers and sticker books my poor parents um, but this is a really really cool one because it includes activities as well as stickers and then the second one is just like amazing stickers puffy stickers glitter stickers foil stickers glossy stickers and it's a four sheet sticker book and i'm looking here and i'm like oh my gosh i have been missing this all of my life i love it puffy stickers wow glitter stickers like iridescent stickers oh dollar tree why are you so amazing glossy stickers Dollar Tree, you never cease to amaze me. I love Dollar Tree. It's the highlight of my week, going into Dollar Tree, picking up all this stuff. I just don't know. 
Anyways, thank you so much for sticking around and hanging out with me while I showed you all of my haul here. Um, I will be coming back at you next Tuesday, so stay tuned for the next edition. Remember to like and subscribe. Click on that notification bell because if you do, you'll be notified every time I upload. So thanks for sticking around and have a great day. Bye, guys.